Yeah, yeah miss. Um, I've been intently um, listening to your uh, speech, and um, there are certain things here that I would like to question. Among them is your figure of the 14,000 people basically killed in JK. The other is the um, amount of money that you said, that, or you claim, that was validated by um, the Ombudsman. That's basically true. Um, however, there are certain figures, certain facts that were presented by no less than Senator Cayetano that actually disputes that number. And also, I have information also from the Philippines uh, stating no less from the AMLA, uh, Anti-Money Laundering Council, that basically disputes the, the figures. The information did not come from them. And um, also in your speech, you stated that we need to say the truth, right? So can you explain this to me? How come some of those figures don't add up? Um, just a quick comment on the waiver. Um, asking the president to sign a waiver is just like you're asking him to incriminate himself in the eyes of the court of stupidity, right? So that's not gonna happen. My real question is this. Um, a lot of things that you said today is contradicting to uh, the 86% approval of the president. And also, uh, like, you know, 90% of Filipinos in abroad and even in our country approve the president. So, for example, like this, right? Oh, no, 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 my name is Ron Rico. I've been in the States for more than 30 years. I'm an ex-veteran. I'm from the U.S. Air Force okay. quite a long time ago. I just came back from the Philippines. Oh. Okay. So I heard all kinds of stories. So I tried to feel the pulse of the people. And guess what? Majority of the people love the type mm -hmm. Whether you like it or not, yeah. it's the truth. Okay? Yeah. That's, that's how I felt. The question, now, the question is, okay, you were part of the prior administration, weren't you? Right? Okay. The drugs problem then were worse. Okay? And or the third is just addressing it. Okay? Now, corruption then was was really bad. You have the worst airport under the old administration. Okay? Your customs were so bad. And one thing that really got me about you was when the third thing tried to go after the drunk people, of course, you're against them because it's a e J K, right? right? But then when he started going after the police, then you said, oh, he's throwing the police under the bus. Okay. So he can't win. Okay. So I'm just telling you right now that I'm calling you out for your life. Question, Senator, is uh, this forum is about human rights, correct? Um, human rights is universal. And I would like to find out uh, what can you do as a senator to protect the human rights of the victims of the drug addicts, children that are being raped and killed, parents that are raping their own children. The CHR in the Philippines are not covering this. What can you do as a senator? Yeah. Good evening, uh, Mr. Senator. Uh, this is uh, from a military vet to a fellow military vet, okay? You were talking to uh, Senator Rubio, right? Can, I, can you honestly say that this is not a backdoor diplomacy, like what you did in, uh, with China?